It was a mild day across the region, a high of 48 degrees this afternoon in Lafayette. A couple locations did reach 50, including Chalmers and Rossville, 48 for a high in Kokomo, and also 48 in Fowler this afternoon. And with the cloud cover, temperatures have not dropped too much. Still sitting at 45 degrees in Lafayette, with winds from the south southwest just around 8 miles per hour, with temperatures still staying in the mid 40s, 45 in Rossville and Kokomo, and currently. 46 degrees in Crawfordsville. This is a system we're keeping our eye on. This is going to bring us our next chances for rain showers. You can see the low pressure spinning in the central Great Plains. That's going to track north and east through the Great Lakes and bring us our next chances for rain showers. But that won't move in until tomorrow afternoon. We should stay dry tonight, but we will be left with overcast skies and also the potential for some patchy fog to develop, especially during the early morning hours. And that low pressure system will bring us rain chances for both Monday and also into Tuesday with up to a half an inch of rain throughout the viewing area possible. And behind it, much cooler air is going to move in. We're expecting highs to return into the mid to upper 30s by the middle part of next week. But tonight, because of the cloud cover, Temperatures are not going to drop too much, just around 43 degrees at 3 o'clock in the morning and eventually 42 for an overnight low in Lafayette. We'll have lows in the lower 40s, 41 in Frankfurt and Delphi, overnight low of 41 up in Winamax. And temperatures won't climb up too much either because of the cloud cover. 44 degrees at noon. You can see the rain showers do move in by the afternoon and then 46 for an afternoon high by 4 o'clock. Still seeing a chance for scattered rain showers. Highs will be in the upper 40s, 47 in Delphi, 45 for a high in Williamsport, and also 45 degrees in Crawfordsville. We'll start up high res future cast again for tomorrow morning. You can see all the clouds still hanging around the region, and notice the rain showers do move, move in just around the lunch hour. Scattered rain showers stay in the forecast all through tomorrow evening and into Tuesday morning. Here sh this shows Tuesday at 7 o'clock in the morning dealing with wraparound rain showers as that low pressure system does continue to track north and east. Still seeing a chance for rain by Tuesday evening. Much cooler air will filter in behind that system with temperatures falling into the 30s. We'll stay in the 40s for Monday and Tuesday, but dropping to 34 for an afternoon high by Wednesday and then 35 Thursday with temperatures staying in the 30s for the extended period, returning into the lower 30s by next weekend. But for tonight, we'll drop to 42 degrees overcast skies. We're expecting to stay dry tonight, but we do have the potential for patchy fog to develop. That will last until tomorrow morning with a high of 46 degrees tomorrow afternoon with scattered rain showers moving in later in the day. The rain chances stay in the forecast through Tuesday with a high of 44 degrees Tuesday and then 34 by next Wednesday. Skies will become partly cloudy Wednesday and Thursday and will stay dry for the second half of the work week. But notice temperatures will be much cooler with lows in the lower 20s and highs in the mid 30s and then dropping into the lower 30s by next week. And we have another system that will move in Friday night and into Saturday. It looks like it will bring a chance for a wintry mix with temperatures falling right back into the lower 30s, mid 30s next Sunday with partly cloudy skies. Well,